I'm Howard Hale with the Harvest USA Report. I'll be back with the Harvest Report from Fort Morgan, Colorado in a moment. If you have an egg business, boy, you need to be a part of eggsearch.us, horsemanscorner.com, cattlemanscorner.com, or harvestusareport.com. Those are sites that we promote on 22 great radio stations, and they get a tremendous amount of visitors every day. Every day, there's a bunch of people looking for egg businesses just like yours. So be a part of eggsearch.us, horsemanscorner.com, cattlemanscorner.com, or harvestusareport.com. Our report today is from Jim Zirian. He's a Nebraska custom harvester working at Fort Morgan, Colorado. When were you able to get going there at Fort Morgan? We got going on Saturday afternoon. How's the crop turning out there? Well, it, this seems to be an area for saw fly, so we're really trying to stay on top of it as as soon as it's ripe we're trying to get it cut if we can get that done we're looking at some pretty doggone good wheat it really surprised me you know 40s and 50s and what's test weight good yeah i believe what we've done so far has been around 60 that saw fly makes your harvesting a little difficult if that wheat goes down doesn't it yeah it slowed us up and we're we're cutting just as close as we dare uh, we're we're sure getting we're getting most of it I think. Where were you working before you got to Fort Morgan? We couldn't get to uh, Garden City, so we came all the way from the Great Bend area. How did it turn out for you in the Great Bend area? They had a really nice crop. We got it out in good shape. Right in the middle of it, we had a pretty good rain, and then it cooled off. We had high humidity and no sunshine, and we sat for eight days. Custom Harvester Jim Zirian, thanks for joining us. More on the web at HarvestUSAReport.com. May God bless. Join us again, won't you? I'm Howard Hale.